Welcome back, Dab Fam. We are here with a brand new video because one of our new subscribers, thank you, yes, Gabe408, had asked us a question if Tiki Quartz was possibly better than G West Quartz because he was going to make a purchase, but he didn't want to have to buy both, you know, he wanted to, you know, figure out which one was the better one. So I'm here today with a Tiki Quartz and of course my brand new G West Quartz that I got a few days ago. Um, right off the back, just by looking at both of the bangers, you can see the difference. The G West Quartz obviously has a deeper bucket it's a full weld the weld looks really nice you can kind of see um i also have the matching opal g west pearl turk pearls um you can kind of see here on the tiki on the tiki and it's a uh, it's a contender just by looks. It has a long neck. It has a long neck just like the G West. The weld is a little more uh, two piece, you know, like a. You could tell that the it's not a full weld. It's a little tighter. I kind of like the full weld better than this, you know, attached banger banger part. Um, this has the Deschutes glass. Turp pearls. Um, you could kind of see the bangers already, you know, not as deep. And that's going to be a problem. I mean, if you like to take fat dabs, I like to take fat dabs. Uh, you can't take them deep. You can't take them too fat because then a lot of your oil is going to end up going down, you know, your, deep your, your stem. Suction in, yeah. So... Fat Boy Glass Fabergé Egg with the Tiki versus the OJ Glass RBR with the G West. I mean, I'm not going to lie. Right off the back, without even hitting a torch to it, and I have not used these Tiki Quartz yet. They're, they look good, but I mean... A deeper barrel. From experience. Yes, just from experience, the deeper barrel is always better. Now, granted, this banger is forty dollars. This banger is fifty dollars. Now, for ten dollars, it's it's gonna be yeah, worth a couple millimeters more deeper. It's going to be worth it. And the weld looks a little cleaner on, on the G weld, the G West glass. Um, we're also going to use for the G West glass, we're going to use the OTP spinner cap G West glass. For the Fat Boy glass and the Tiki Quartz, we're going to go use the Deschutes glass spinner cap okay and I guess we're just gonna go ahead and mess with this live resin right here cookie breath looking really really terpy so you guys can see that really terpy there that's the cookie breath and we have the white runts right here Looking mm. nice and juicy, and juicy as you can see that. So it's what we're so gonna yummy. do? Yes, very yummy. We're just gonna go ahead and you know break these bangers in and you know put them to the test <laughs> and give you guys an honest opinion of these two bangers. Because so do we start with the one we know already experience with, or go with the new? I'm going to say we're going to go with the G West first. First. Now, we get the G West Blizzard, the G West Shredder, the Blender. The Blender, I mean, sorry, Blizzard. G West Blender, the G West Shredder, the G West 
auto spinner, and of course, <coughs> just like you guys, we get the the bare quartz. Um, when campfire quartz was popping earlier last year, um, you know we were doing the campfire quartz as well. Um, got an Evan Shore banger here. With uh, time, you didn't experience. You know, you either upgrade or you know which ones become your more favorite. Yes, and as the time go tos, the go tos for us have really been the G West glass. But like I said. And for different styles, because they do carry different styles yeah. and varieties from just going to your local shop. Yeah, and the Tiki Quartz has a few different other styles of banger too, but we're just going to go with the traditional regular style banger. Um, give us a second and we'll be back with... The G West. You know what? Let's just do this tiki because we haven't even tried it and I do want to try it. We'll, we're going to hit you guys with this tiki quartz first. So when we come back, we will have this on the dab right and almost ready to load up. All right, you guys. Hold on. And just like that, we're, we're back, back with this terpy, terpy cookie breath. Let's see. Everything's set in motion. Just gotta, tiki's heat. Tiki's heated. Let's take a, let's just, we gotta break this in with a nice, a nice dab. And we gotta go in a little warm. No, we don't. Just, that's how this, that's how Warm she, is fine, that's how she not likes hot. It. Nice and hot. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what this tiki is about. Um, it's shedding degrees. Little fast, just a so little it fast. Doesn't retain the heat too long. Not but too long. I mean, a little fast. See. I guess we should have timed it. Yeah, but let's see. Five. Oh, whoa, five seventy. Okay. Kind of tiki. Tiki is not retaining the heat as well as what I'm used to with the G West. But we're gonna have to show you guys. The dab right went from too hot. Ooh, I mean that is that's a cloud. I'm not gonna lie. It's a cloud. Okay, maybe I can get a little of this action it did taste a little hot oh yeah it's it's gonna be a hot hot girl let me tell you here we go a close-up of the tiki quartz it's a different a little bit of a different heat let me tell you Pretty, pretty terpy. Okay. Those are the Deschutes Terp Pearls and Deschutes Spitter Cap. Okay, you guys. Well, you know, to be honest, the first TP, impression. First impression. Uh, one to ten, I would give it probably a six, six and a half. That's not too bad. Not too bad for Tiki Quartz. Didn't retain the heat as long as I'm used to with my regular everyday G West banger. But let's go ahead and see how many dabs we can get out of this G West banger. What do you guys think? Okay, we're going to go ahead and clean this one up. And when we come back, we will have the OJ glass. Of course, the G West with the OTP and the G West matching opals, opal turp pearls. All right, you guys. Next scene, we will have this girl on that dab right. Boom. And just like that, we're back with this white runts. Okay. Give you a little scoop out of her. 
Nice and goopy. Nice and terpy. This is gonna be a foul one right here. Okay. <laughs> G West is going at minus three. The Tiki was going at minus five. Okay. So the Tiki doesn't retain the heat as much. But the G West stays a little hot. Let me see if I can't get you a good, nice angle. There it is right there. There we go. It's a little bit, a little bit thicker of a cloud. Stays in that banger better. Does it taste that burnt? Yeah. Or harsh that? How does that white runs taste? Pretty decent. It tastes good. Look at that. That's a lot of dabs out of that one banger. Keep going. I thought you wanted to. I'm it. going to. I just wanted to see how many we can you could get back. Back and forth. Oops. Okay, here we go. Mm. See if I can get another one. And another one. Oh, yeah. Mm. You guys are seeing it. It's retaining that heat. And one more small one. There it is. Let's see if you can't get one more baby one. Mm. Oh, a little baby one. Okay, well. There it is, you guys. Five of them. <laughs> yeah, that was that a lot one. of rips from that one, one banger. That. But I'm just going to have to give you my honest opinion and let you guys know that G West, man, they're the winner here in this versus because it retains heat. It's yeah, less messier. Our opinion, but our opinion yeah. from experience and what we've just witnessed. Yeah. Um, An experience. This Tiki Quartz is not a bad banger. If you want to spend thirty nine ninety nine and get you a decent... Plus tax. Plus tax. If you want to get you a decent banger, you can go ahead and get this Tiki, but... but we'll have to see how long it lasts without yeah, pausing. Yeah, and that too. That'll be another video in a few months to uh, update to show you guys how long this Quartz lasts versus... And with this, look at... With the... Yeah, see that right there? How you it can, can get in there in and there. clean all in there when as you get that, to the other? When you get that full weld, it's it's a little easier to get in there like that and clean that neck. But the better thing about this is that... It, a whole lot of your oil doesn't go up yeah, the neck. Yeah, it doesn't go up the neck. And, you know, it's a little bit wider, a little bit uh, deeper. And that little bit of deeper... From here is, to here is the difference. To make a big difference from oh, here yeah. to here. Let me get this for the JPEG. There to there. Let's see. There we go. That's for the JPEG, you guys. This will be the picture you guys see when you check out the video. But G West wins. Tiki Torch, like I said, not a bad, not a bad banger. If you want to, you know, spend thirty nine. You might can even get it for you know a couple dollars cheaper if you know the the shop owner, but I have no problem with spending a little bit of extra and, and getting get a, a better quality. Food. And you know what? Since you guys stayed to the end of the video, see, since you guys stayed, Tiki Quartz G West Glass in the end. G West Glass wins. But like I said, 
Tiki isn't bad. And but they don't come with the benefit like G West does. Yeah. And entices you to come back for more business with their handy dandy yeah. discount. Discount. Yes, you're welcome. There it is right there. Fifty percent off. Thank you, 15. It all adds up. It all adds up, trust me. You end up getting the G West banger, you know, for less. If you spend $100 on G West, you're going to get $15 back. You can't beat that. Can't beat that. All right, you guys. Thank you for joining us. Joining us. The verses. Yes. Thanks and for your comments. Thank you for the comments. And again, big shout out to Gabe408 because... I wouldn't have gotten the, the banger without, you know, his suggestion or question. So, thanks for tuning in and stay lit. Peace. Until next time.